mediation efforts at institutions facing tension. This week, violence broke out at the universities of Pretoria, Northwest, and the Free State. In the Northwest, Higher Education Minister Mduduzi Manana says that students must guard against their genuine concerns being hijacked for political grandstanding. Manana insists that there is a deliberate attempt to collapse higher education in the country and consequently the state. He was meeting the management of the Northwest University in Mahikeng following violent protests there. We believe that there is a deliberate program to collapse the higher education system. A strong sentiment at the height of violent student protests across the country. At this campus, it's been a week marked by acts of violence, intimidation and vandalism. Scores injured and university property set alight. We've had to at least find, I mean, find 2.3 billion rand through reprioritization, of course. We found that money, there was no fee in, there's no fee increment for 2016, and then it was outsourcing. Universities are dealing with the matter, they assist with this, with this, with this issue. Then it's language policy in some of our institutions. It will be something else tomorrow. It cannot continue like that. The university is looking ahead. As soon as the assessment is done, there will then be a plan worked out, and as you have suggested, that would also include some compromises in terms of uh, holidays and times, but we are going to rescue the semester. A damage runs into millions, lectures remain suspended, and the university has been closed indefinitely. Management says it will take at least a month before they resume. Selotatai, SABC News, Mahi.